Hi everybody, it's Dr. Salce. Today we have Renee with us and she's going to be telling us her chiropractic story of how chiropractic has helped her and how it's changed her life. My name is Renee Saban Parsi. I was in a horrific car accident. I rolled my car, I did two flips in the air and I landed on my tires. My head went through the windshield, came back out and I got whiplash. I have tendonitis, my, the ligaments were torn, my hips were dislocated. You could see the seat belt mark completely across my body at that time. I've had off and on throughout the years multiple problems with my back, primarily my smaller, my lower back. As I have experienced a lot of sensory neuropathy in my lower limbs and my arms, which led to the diagnosis of fibromyalgia, I've learned that chiropractic care is super important for us because it allows the nerves in our body to communicate with the rest of our body. And I understand that the nerves are a big, big role. If those lines are not open for communication, then how is our body to know what is going on with ourselves inside and out? Get through and see how you're doing. All right, so we're gonna start out with your neck. So bring your head forward. And as I'm checking your spine, we're looking for something called subluxation, misalignment, and if there's any tenderness in there, let me know. Right there. Mm -hmm. A little high, right about there, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it we're radiates gonna... to the middle finger. Okay, so we're gonna definitely get that adjusted for you. Okay. Now let's check the other side here. Right How there. about there? Mm -hmm. Okay. And a little up. A little higher, right mm -hmm. here. Okay. So it's about C two, three, and four where we're finding some misalignment. We'll definitely get that adjusted for her. We're gonna keep going, and we're gonna check your spine through here. So I'm just straighten out your back. And I'm just gonna run my hand down your back, and let me know if any of this is tender. Right there. Right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is about T6. T6 actually has innervation down to uh, the stomach and uh, can help with digestion by getting this area open. We're going to keep going. Right there. It okay. starts to get tender. And this is the fifth lumbar, fourth lumbar. That's innervation down into your legs. So let's go ahead and take care of that for you. Okay. okay. Sounds great. All right. So the first thing we're going to check is your leg length. Uh, leg length tells me a lot about how your spine is doing. And what I'm seeing here is that you have a short leg on the left side, and it's about, maybe about three to four millimeters. And typically that's coming from the hip, so we're going to check your hip and see what's happening with that. Sounds good. So we're going to go ahead and um, do an adjustment for that. All you're going to feel is the table move up and down, okay. and you feel a little push right here. And this is called the drop table, and the drop table will just realign the pelvis. Let's take a look and see if that made a difference. And you can see the legs are now nice and even. Okay, so let's continue. And we're going to look more deep into the hips here. We're going to check the spine through palpation again on the lying down position. Okay. So the first one we're going to do is the fifth lumbar. We're going to do that in side posture. So what I'd like you to do is let's get you to lie on your side. Okay, we're going to bring you back a little bit. Mm -hmm. There it is. A little more. Okay, now let's go ahead and get you to sit up all the way. Now we talked about T6, and that's right between your shoulder blades right here. We're going to take care of that. I'd like you to just cross your arms and tuck your chin for me. There it is, right here. So if you can come around this way to catch this. Uh, bring your head down. I'm going to bring you back this way. There you go. Okay, come on up. Now let's take care of your neck. So as I'm palpating, I'm checking for the atlas and checking for range of motion there, but we're gonna go down to C2 where I'm feeling that restriction in that joint right there. And we're gonna go ahead and release that. We're gonna contact on the lamina here and we're gonna use a form of the Gonset adjustment here. So I want you to just let your head fall. There it is. Okay, now we got a piece of it, but there's more in there. So we're gonna go ahead and take care of the rest, okay? So I want you to let your head fall into my hand there it is, drop here. Okay, so there's another part of it. We're gonna get the rest on this side now. 
Mm -hmm. And this is at C4. Let your head fall. Drop here. That's the one. Okay, fantastic. Now, the other thing is, is that your job is uh, as a hairstylist as well, isn't it? Yes. So you're on your feet a lot, uh, always using your hands, mm -hmm. and we yes. get a lot of hairstylists in here. And so what we want to do is we want to work on your hands so we can prevent carpal tunnel for you. Yes. Okay? Thank you. All right, let's do that. So let me have this hand. And oh, you can even see the scissors here on her tattoo. So here we go. All you're going to feel is just a little bit of a push right in this area here. And that's all it is right there. Then we're going to approximate the ulna and the radius. We're going to bridge the carpals and we'll do the same thing on the other side. So the bone we're looking at is the lunate right here. And then you're going to feel the bones of the ulna radius approximate, again, bridging the carpals. And we're done. Thank you. You're very welcome. I definitely feel a bigger um, healing process in my body. My lower back on the right side has definitely calmed down. The inflammation is a lot better. I can feel when my eating habits are on point versus off point. I have had less headaches, less migraines. Um, my back is not hurting at the end of the day anymore and I feel like I can stretch and walk physically a lot better than I was able to before. All right. Well, we look forward to seeing more with your life coaching, Thank what you. happens with that. I'm excited. Thank yeah. you. And we really appreciate you coming today and we look forward to taking care of you in the future. Thank you guys. All right. We'll see you.